Hey everybody, welcome to 2012. This is Jim, the Virgo Gourmet. Sorry I've been gone for so long, but we got busy with the holidays and I just wanted to give a real quick evening um, appetizer that we're going to do tonight. This is Lissanato Kale. It's a flat kale. We're going to be making kale chips. Maybe you've heard about them in the last couple of years. I have. I've not tried them. So we're going to start by taking it, washing it, laying out, letting it dry as you can see here. You take it, take a leaf, get, get you a nice one, cut off the end, start trim out the vein like that, trim out the vein like that, throw it away. Take your parts about an inch and a half or so, we're going to do that, put them in a bag. Put some olive oil, a little salt, shake them up, tray them up, and I'll show you this part when we get back, but I'm going to go ahead and get started here, and we'll be right back. Thanks. Hey, everybody. Welcome back. As I told you, we were going to cut this up and get ready to go. First of all, I'd like to introduce my friend John. John, meet my audience. Hi there. Hey, everybody. <laughs> Again, the type of kale is... You can't pronounce it, can you? La Sonato. La Sonato. Thank you, John. We planned this before we were filming. We got it. Uh, but what I did is, you can see, I took the kale, cut it up small, cut the vein out like I showed you in the very beginning. Now we're just going to do this. Now, this is a, is a Virgo Gourmet thing. This is in no textbook. We're going to take and put the two tablespoons or so of olive oil, drizzle it, drench it in, take about two teaspoons of Kosher salt, Does that sea be salt. Kosher salt, sea salt is another great alternative also. You can use a crank, you crank it in, okay, hold the bag up and just shake like this, just stir it. It's not coated at all, with all it, oil. It makes it even coating. Yeah. So we're going to do this. There's no need to spray the pan because of the olive oil on the kale. Exactly. We're going to do this up like this, and then John's going to help me. We're just going to divide it out between the, the pan. And then nice? you want to separate it so it crisps up, right? Isn't that nice? Isn't that right? You just sort of sprinkle it out even layers. I can't get to do that. Single layer, just like that. All the single layers. Yep. <laughs> Not too much salt on that one. I'll just wipe some off here and change that up a little bit. Yeah, just so you want it, um, you want air air movement around it, and so there's not so much piled up. And we're going to bake it at 275. We're going to check it at 20 minutes. And we'll be right back here in just a minute, okay? Thanks. Good job, John. Hey, everybody, we're back. It's been 10 minutes, and we're going to stir them halfway through. John, you want to help me with yeah, that? Yeah, with it, sure. Go ahead and pull that out. Just, just pull one tray out. We're going to reset the timer for another 10 minutes. Oh, they really dry out. Are they crispy yet? They're getting crispy. All right. So like we're going to reset them for 10 minutes. And we're just going to, um, I think we should turn them, just, just kind of fluff them up a little bit so they don't like stick, just kind of like that and see where they're, they're darker green. So let's just kind of roll them over a little bit, stir them up, and then I'll let you shake Now how them. long does this take total? 20 minutes total. 20 minutes, that's not bad. And so we've got 10, and I'm going to go ahead and reset them for another 10 here. But we'll just kind of stir that up, and if you'll... Um, We'll loosen them from the bottom and just go ahead and just shake that back out to where it's kind of level all through. So what are they? Yeah, just kind of one layer. Yeah, there we go. We're good. Ooh, they smell real, real good. They do they? smell good. All right. We're going to be right back. We're going to go ahead and stir three more trays. Thanks, folks. Hey, everybody. We're back. It's been the 20 minutes that we promised. We're going to go ahead and pull them out. And, um, oh, look at that. That's crispy. Wow. Yeah. Let me get another pad and we'll pull these out. And, uh, nice. They're really, really crispy. I'm, I'm a huge potato chip eater. Yes. And this could be a really good alternative to that. I'm, that's exactly what I'm guessing. So. I'll wait and be a nice and wait. See, everybody, see, see, too. see, they dry and they float around. Nice. John, thanks for coming over tonight. No problem. Appreciate it. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs> These are good. Here's to you trying kale chips, everybody. Thanks, and mm -hmm. have a great week. And remember, don't just say whatever. There really is a difference. Thanks.